Okay, welcome back everybody. So we're gonna keep going here with these window buildings. So I built another frame, uh, just like in the last video, only I actually properly accounted for the spacing on either side by minusing from the top and the bottom what the width of the board sides were from the actual width of the window. So the only difference with this one is it's gonna be an opening and closing window and we're gonna be using this clear plastic here. So I'm gonna make this video pretty short. Uh, all we're gonna do is we're gonna take these one by ones here and we're gonna build another frame inside of this frame with the one by ones. And we're gonna take the plastic, the clear plastic, and we're gonna wrap it around and behind those so that way it stays in there nice. And as you can see, I used a two by two at the top so the hinge has something really strong to hold on to and I also reinforced the bottom by doubling up this super thin and flimsy board this one by one is also going to actually add quite a bit of support to the entire frame so once again what I'm going to do here is I'm gonna take this uh, one by one and I'm gonna build a frame piece by piece and as I'm building it, I'm going to take this clear plastic and I'm simply going to wrap it around it so that way the, the one by one is what's holding the clear plastic inside of this frame. And that's going to give me a nice solid window and I can kind of pull it tight. It's not going to be quite as tight as this screen turned out to be, but it will still be fairly tight. And then I'm going to put some hinges on the top so that the whole thing can open and close nice and smooth. So thanks for watching. I know this video was pretty quick, but if you saw the last video, then you'll understand this video quite easily. So thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll post a video once all the windows are complete. What up, everybody? I just got a quick addition to this last video here. So after working on this a little bit more, I figured uh, some people might have some trouble figuring out how to properly attach the plastic to the inner frame. So what I've done here, it's hard to tell, but I actually have a layer of plastic here and it's cut to size already. And I've got my exterior frame and I've laid down the plastic and now I'm just gonna take my interior frame with the plastic laid over the exterior frame and I'm just going to take it, line it up, make sure that my plastic is sticking out around all of the edges, and then I'm just going to push this frame down inside of that. And what that's going to do is it's going to force the plastic to go onto the outside in between the interior frame and the exterior frame. So once again, I just laid down my plastic over the exterior frame so it's sitting on top of it. And then I put the interior frame on top of the plastic and just push it down, thereby locking the plastic in between the two frames. And if it seems a little bit weak, I'll probably add a support in the middle just so I have something else to attach that plastic to if it seems like it's a little bit loose in there. So hopefully this helps out and clears out any problems that anyone was having. Um, I noticed it's not quite as easy to stretch the plastic over the other uh, frame as I did before is this frame is a lot harder to work with uh, being so flimsy so you can see how I attach the frame to each side is joist up against another side kind of so they're all inlaid I don't have any anything where it's like on the outside with two boards attached to it each board is kind of attached to the outside of another board which makes it a lot easier to build the frame so thanks again for watching and i hope uh hope you all have some fun building some windows